Right here, I got the unreleased fragment clock dunk. And you guys know what time it is when it comes to the clocks. Before we get started, I'd like to give a big shout out to Whatnot for making it possible for us to cut this shoe. Before we go any further or cut any deeper, into this episode, I kind of want to break down exactly yeah, what's going let's on. Talk about it. Here, grab yeah. it. So what we have here is we have the fragment clot dunk. I love this shoe. Straight love off the rip. Straight off the rip. And you guys know that when you see the silky, that there's an actual hidden layer underneath. Yeah, the first time they ever used this was on the Air Force One. It was actually the very first Air Force One colorway to come out was this exact same color. Right. And so I'm assuming now, they might do more dunks. And now they've done like dust pink, yeah. black, and several gold, other blue and, rose other, gold. and other colors like that. So let's just kind of break it down on the back. You got clot on the left side. And what do you have on the back of yours? We got fragment. Fragment on the other side. So the and other, the Air Forces weren't fragment collabs. No, they, they, were just, they were just clot. Nike. There was one that was a fragment collab. It was okay. a black one, and I think it was red underneath. Nice. And it was one clot fragment Air Force One. And I will say, we have not cut a clot before. No. I've seen people come in. I've Never. been to sneaker cons. I've been to several different events where I've seen it done. Even Larry's, I, I believe, has done one to one of his as well. But okay. we've actually never actually gone in and cut one ourselves. Insoles, on one you're going to see you have the clot and the fragment logo. On the other, you just have the Nike logo. I do like the icy sole. It's not even icy. This is just like yeah, clear, clear, yeah, clear, clear white. It's not the clear blue. No, not it's the clear, just clear blue. Clear, just clear. clear white. Now, I will say that this over time will oxidize very, very bad. And mm -hmm. it will turn brown around the bottom trim really, really bad. But dead stock, it looks beautiful in all honesty. Right here, it's all leather. Feel that leather. Yeah, the leather's It's good fire. leather. It's nice, soft leather. And this, the insole is different. Is the insole leather too? What is that? Why does oh, it feel wow. like, it's like soft or something. No, it feels like a, feels like a rubber mat. It's like a rubber mat. Like yeah. a yoga mat. Yeah, that's what it feels like. Uppers have leather along the lace holes. And then all I got is just the regular Nike on the tongues. You just have a regular Same Nike. Thing. Anything underneath? Nope. I'm gonna tell you right Nothing now, Scott, underneath. I see a fragment logo right there. Oh shit. You see? Oh, yeah, yeah, I do there's, too. There's fragment logos under there. There it is. I have, wow. to assume, I have to assume it's gonna be like all the other clots where it's just like a reverse of this pattern that's on but the they're soap. Doing, they're doing it a collab with fragments, so maybe they're doing something cool. Now, yeah. you guys told me there's somebody on the internet right now that cut it, but they just cut the yeah. check. No, 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 they didn't cut the check. They cut where the fragment logo was. And then that they, was it. They just took a little square out right there and just made like a little window. So what we it. don't know is there could be different multicolor Oh, there could be all panels. sorts of stuff all over. Different. I feel sad doing this because it's such a pretty shoe. But. Where would you like for me to cut. I look No, you you're starting on that. that you just want to go straight to the flap? I want the, yeah, I want the flap straight yeah. out. All right. And don't cut too deep on it. I'm scared right now. You know, they tell you to cut away from me. Trust me. I should know. Oh, he's doing it again. That thumbs. I'm not taking you to the hospital. I feel like I see nothing but just white underneath. Please have something cooler. It's just white. It's just white. It's usually, just solid white. Usually it's another. I'm disappointed. I'm kind of disappointed, bro. It's not even a good leather. Is it? It's that. No, it's just some like regular. Is that McDonald's leather? Yeah, Mickey D. There's a little embroidered stitch though. It's kind of cool. You want me to do some more? Let's just do, do it. Do the toe box first. Okay. I'm excited for that. Okay, let's do the toe box. Yeah, like what if there's like a big fragment logo or something? Do you think it's still white though, or do you think they did colors? I feel like they had to have just kept it all white because if they did any other colored panels, you'd see the difference through the silk. The only thing they could have done is put hits all over it, like fragment hits. Huh? Okay. More white. Nothing, bro. White. <laughs> oh, Scott, I see it. Hey. I swore I. Don't. I swore I saw it on no, this one. Don't. I see it. It's like some crazy don't embroidery slip. right here. Oh, that's maybe it then, right? There it is. Oh, there's something there. So they just embroidered the same regular fragment logo, but it's right there. No, it's oh, a clot. Oh, the clot logo. A little clotty. Okay, that's tight. Clotties. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! This might have been a better shoe without this top layer. Wait, just what? like an all white dunk with just the little hits everywhere. No. Hmm. I like the, I like the silky. This is a very sad cutting. It's like there's something underneath, but it's just still so sad because it's so boring. I'm telling you, if the shoe was all white with just the hits and the clear sole, the embroidery, so. I feel like I would keep it'd the, be way like more I'd hard. Keep this panel. Like, what if you cut all of them except for that panel? Like, that's harder to me. 
That's a cooler shoe, in my opinion, than just all white. Like, I feel like you that was the intention. Keep the check or something. Oh, th that's exactly what you should do. Keep the check. Oh, 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 oh is that a little swoosh? Yeah, you oh, should I get a better cut. I don't know if I can really get, I mean, I could on this part. There it goes. There you go. Now, are we gonna cut this one? I say go for it. Oh, he's switching it up. Anything on the inside? Are we taking up any bets, Scott? Do you think there's anything on the inside panels? No. Because if that's the case, I feel like if you're gonna cut this shoe, you might as well just leave all the inside panels intact. You know what I mean? Mm. That was a good cut. <laughs> I heard it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm so upset. Throw it right now. I'll throw it. Again, this is in the name of sneaker science because we have no idea. No one's told us. We haven't seen anybody else do it yet. So I mean, I heard about it. Yeah, I heard about the back. That's I didn't it. watch the video, so I don't know. I think that's it, Scott. It kind of reminds me of the Travis Scott um, Air Force One. You know that very first one that came out? Yeah, they the did that weird little, yeah. It feels like an Air Force One now with that extra big ribbing on it. Oh, yeah, there's a big one under this one. Oh. It looks cool like this. Like I like the silk on like all of the piping on it. So the three collaborations, you have the Clot, you have Fragment, and then you have Nike. So it's the three different companies making up the one shoe. On the outside of the foot. On the outside, yeah. It's clean. It's would clean. look way cooler all white. Really? No yeah. silk? Yeah, I would even make this part white. You don't even want to cut it? I'm not saying keep the black. I would make this white and just have black up here on, yeah. the, on the thing and black on the tongue. I like, I, I'm not gonna lie. like. Regardless, even if it is kind of like chill, like I like this shoe. Yeah, shoe's cool. I wanted this shoe. The concept's cool and the Air Forces and everything. I've just never been a fan of just like a silk. satin shiny style stuff on my shoes. And if you follow me on the YouTube channel, you guys know that I'm not big on like patterns on my on my shoes. I have a few shoes that have patterns. I got like the Supreme chocolate chip camo fives. Foam posits. I got the foam posits, Supreme. the Supreme foam posits. Like very seldomly do I wear things with a lot of patterns all over them. So this one's a more of a subtle because it's like white on white, so it's hard to tell, but it's just it's too much I just want me. you to know this leather is doo-doo. Like uh, it's doo-doo. Doo-doo leather. And I will say that I'm not a fan on this because after the first couple wears, especially if you wear it like on a rainy day or step into a puddle yeah, and it's wet, it. it's gonna get into the sole and it's gonna make it brown. But as far as quality on the inside's nice. The idea of the hits underneath on the outside showing is cool to me. Right. I am glad that they did it like in a white and black like tuxedo colorway. Yeah. I think that's cool. cool. It's clean. It's but clean uh, definitely not something that I would put, personally put into my collection. Drop for me, cool concept. Cop for me, so. Cop and rock? Yeah, cop and rock. Let's see what sure. our employees think and some right, other Adam's people. right here. I don't think they've met Adam. Introduce yourself to the to the show. What's good, I'm Adam. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna ask right now whether or not you think this is a cop or a drop. Hey, just what's your thoughts on it? What's your thoughts on the shoe? This is what it looked like before, obviously. I, yeah. I'm not sure if you've seen it. This is an unreleased clock fragment dump. You know, I like the reveal, yeah. you know, but it just seems so minimal. So it's, it's just too like, boring, too boring, too much work just for like just a couple extras. I think it just keep it, you know, keep it like that. Yeah, Would you cop or drop it? Mm, drop. Oh, OK. All right. All right. It's one for you. Twin. All right, man. What's your thoughts on these cop drop? What's your personal opinion? What are we thinking? Personally, I like them untouched. You leave it like that. I like it like this. Um, yeah. I mean, you cut the entire thing, right? Yeah, well, we had to Every see, because single... we don't know where the little hits are underneath, so right. we had to figure out where they're at. Right. I think it's a really cool design, really cool concept. I like the like the all white look with just the swoosh, right? Yeah. I think that's really cool, really clean, but I like it like this a lot. Is it a cop or a drop for you? I'm gonna drop this. Nah, not uh, for you? Just because after a couple of wears, it wouldn't it wouldn't look as good as it once did. Okay. Don't think it's worth it, but Dang, I, think it's, really, I think it's a really cool shoe though. People don't mess with this shoe. This shoe's hard. Y'all tell me out there if you guys mess with this in the comments, please. Let's go back. Let's stay right there. All right, we're, coming. we're coming to you. All right. Drake opens most of these packages. And a lot of people don't know, but if you see a hand in a lot of these pictures, it's usually this guy. He's the guy that's going viral right now. Hands. Yeah, you got a little soft hands, bro. But we got a question <laughs> for you. This is the cloth fragment, you already know, right? How do you feel about the shoe uncut? And how do you feel about it cut? Oh, I still like this. Still, still like it uncut. It's, it's, Would you cut out for like a little frag logo or not? Leave it. Maybe the frag logo is yeah, in these. I think okay. that's fire. So here's my question. Is this shoe a copper drop for you when it releases? It's a cop. Easy? Yeah. Straight cop. to toe? Mm -hmm. That's 2-1. I lost. 2-1? 
if you want, Scotty. Down below, the real question is, is, will you be getting this shoe? And you could possibly get these kind of shoes because we also go live on whatnot and we also give away and sell early birds. But right now we've teamed up with them to do what? The early chance. So you're gonna get an early chance at getting sneakers before they release exclusively through whatnot, courtesy of private selection, tune in. Yeah, all you gotta do is just download the app and uh, make sure you guys set the notifications and also use the link in our description and you get a free $10. Yep. Shout out to whatnot for making this possible. We appreciate it. And down below, tell us your thoughts. What you think about the shoe? Cop or Drop. P.S. You know you've seen it here first. Any questions? You could buy it all at the private selection. P.S. You know you've seen it here first. Any questions? You could put it on at the private selection. P.S. You know you've seen it here first. Any questions? You could buy it all at the private selection. P.S. You know you've seen it here first. Any questions? Go sneaker shopping at the private selection.